family. Welcome back to the Ebony Odyssey. My name is Jermango Long, and I am a servant of the Most High God. I appreciate you for coming along, and as always, enjoy the journey. Uh, today, um, I've been reading in the Apocrypha, and some things came to my mind as I was reading. Um, I'm in the book of Yasher. And I'm on chapter 15, and it is verses 40 and 41. Um, and it speaks of uh, pretty much Abraham and Lot, uh, where they were together. And then, um, you know, Lot ended up going towards Sodom. So let me read uh, just a portion of this. Uh, verse 40, it goes, And Abram quarreled daily with Lot on account of this, about the grazing, but Lot would not listen to Abram, and he continued to do the same, and the, inha and the inhabitants of the land came and told Abram. And Abram said unto Lot, How long will you be with me for a stumbling block with the inhabitants of the land? Now I implore you, let there be no more quarreling between us, for we are kinsmen. But I pray you separate from me and go and choose a place where you may dwell with your cattle and all belonging to you. But keep yourself at a distance from me, you and your household. Be not afraid in going from me, for if anyone do an injury to you, let me know and I will avenge your cause from him. Only remove from me. And so I went all the way to uh, 43. And I, I say all that to say this. You know, getting away. Uh, some people are getting away from family members who would cause them trouble. And, you know, I'm here and I, I have no family here. So it, it's not like I have family trouble. I may have something that may go on at the house, um, you know, back home that really I can't do anything uh, with at this time because I'm here and I'm, I'm going forward on this journey. But, you know, even with me being here, you know, you deal with your children in a sense. And I have two young men and they're coming into their own and they're, they'll be grown in no time, uh, a 16 year old and a 14 year old. And, you know, as you get to these teenage years, you know, uh, they often rebel uh, because they want to find their own way. And I'm hoping to facilitate, you know, an atmosphere where they can go and find their own way because it's nothing but opportunity here. It's nothing but a chance for you to succeed. It's nothing but, you know, a place where if you really put your mind to it, you can do some great things for yourself as well as the community that's around you. And I, I say all that to just say that, um, you know, sometimes you got to get people away from you. You know, you may love them and you may care for them as much as humanly possible, but it is nothing else you can do for them because they keep doing what they want to do and not helping. And, you know, that that goes to, you know, the family dynamic as you try to grow, you know, as if I was trying to build something, you know, with family members at home and things of that nature. You know, you, you think about, you know, you're all putting your eggs together. You're trying to, you know, make a dozen, you know, to say the least. And you continue to try to build with people and they continue to hurt you and they continue to um you know, uh, abuse the closeness uh, that you have. And that's pretty much what it's saying in that chapter. It's like, man, you, you're making it hard for me. And it's not that I don't care about you. It's just the point that you're not doing anything that would allow me to gain favor in this place that I'm at. And, and so that's just a hard, you know, hard thing to live with. Uh, but, you know, you got to come in abram abraham uh how he puts this to lot you know he says look man i'm always going to be with you and if you have a problem with anybody just let me know the one thing that i can't do is continue on down this path with you because you are you know counter to my progression and you know 
you know, that's what we have to take into account uh, with our own lives and with the people around us. Uh, you know, I did that video a couple of days ago uh, with Go Black to Africa. And, you know, he was talking about, you know, we, we talked about the employees and, you know, their way of life. And, you know, you get to a point where, you know, hey, if we're not on the same page, you have to go your own way. But at the same time, you just try to make sure that you really have an understanding of what people are going through, who they are, and uh, what purpose uh, are they serving to be with you at this time. Um, and, and so, you know, with that being said, family, I appreciate you for listening. And as always, enjoy it.